imaginary string. Imaginary string. There it goes. I'm going to tie it to my tongue. This oh, tongue is stuck to a string. It is still in my hand. Uh oh. Uh oh. It's really crazy. Uh, 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 uh. Untie it. Okay, I untie it. Yeah, that was crazy. Ah. Hmm. I wonder if I could do it with my leg. I'm gonna tie a string to my leg. Ooh, I'm gonna sew it a little bit. Oh. Hey, I think it's I think it's tight. Let me let me hold the string. Oh. Uh, uh. My leg is heavy. Whoa. Whoa. Untie that one. Be tied to my arm. Nope. Oh my goodness. Oh, I dropped the string. Let me get it again. Okay, I got it. Okay. Hold up my arm. Okay, untie that. I think I could do it with my finger. You try it. You've been trying it? You're just watching me. You try. Let me untie that. Got it? Ah, you're gonna lift it? Oh, I'm gonna tie it to my hand. You do yours. You doing it? Pull it up. Oh, it's pulled. It's pulling my hand up. Up and down. Up and down. That's pretty silly. We could do that with all sorts of body parts, couldn't we? The last one is called Earth, wind, and fire. So earth is gonna be squat. Remember squat? Wind is gonna be tree pose. So earth, wind, or wind. And fire is gonna be fire, star balance. Is it sun, sun like a star? So earth, wind, fire. So I'm gonna say, I'm gonna say one, you copy. Ready? Fire. Remember what to do? Star balance. Fire. What if I said wind? Remember what to do? Wind, either tree blowing in the wind or feet together, wind. Seems silly, but this works our side muscles a lot. And if you squeeze your tusher, it's gonna help your tusher too. Squeeze, there you go. Ooh, wind, earth. Remember what to do when I say earth? Yeah, good. Get tell low, tuck. Okay, what if I say earth, fire? First you do earth, then you do fire. Fire, fire. Ready? Fire, wind. Did you do it? Fire. Wind. What if I say earth, wind, fire? Go! Earth, wind, fire. Ready for a harder one? Earth, wind, earth, fire. Go! 
You need it again. I'll do it backwards. Fire, earth, wind, earth, go. Fire, earth, wind, earth. You want another one? This is like Simon. Have you ever played the game Simon? Ready for another one? Earth, fire, wind, fire. You get it? Earth, fire, earth, wind. Did I do that right? No, I can't remember what I even said. See, it's even hard for adults. Ready for five? Five is a big one. Fire, earth, wind, earth, fire. Get it? Fire, earth, wind, earth, fire. That was a pattern, wasn't it? All right, you could keep playing. Another way you could play is you could draw the three pictures. You could draw a picture of the earth, a picture of fire, and a picture of wind. And your big person can hold it up and you look at it and do it. They hold up two different ones. They hold them up in different orders. They hold up all three. Maybe you make two of each and they can make a pattern on the counter. You go look at it just for a second, run over and do it real quick. And you can make other patterns be other things. So instead of earth, wind, fire, maybe you could do, let's see, water. What can we do for water? Earth, wind, fire, water. Maybe water is like swimming kind of. You could do wind, water, earth, fire. So these types of patterns, adults, if you're watching this, it's that'll help us with our kindergarten readiness skills. So first we go to the bathroom, then we flush, then we wash our hands, then we wipe our hands dry, then we put the towel away, then we turn off the light. That's a lot of steps for little ones. So multiple step directions are super important. The best way for them to practice is with games. Games are the best way for kids to learn that multi-step direction practice. Hope you like those and we'll be seeing you soon. Everybody let off steam, everybody scream. Everybody let off steam, everybody scream. You go first. Does that feel good, Mila? Yes. Okay. No. Laughing game. <laughs> so, you can play with lots of people. What you do is you have someone lay their head on your tummy, and the next person lays their head on that person's tummy, and so on and so forth. If you, you gotta go my belly. <laughs> and the, what we do is we start out with one, one laugh. <laughs> she does two. <laughs> Then if it's two people, I do three. <laughs> Five for me.
There's more than one. <laughs> ow, ow. Um, okay. Do you have to pee? <laughs> no. Okay, you do one. One. <laughs> Thank you, Mila. You're welcome. Oh, I'm giggly. That was a mess. <laughs>